I mean, the strawberries are already in full bloom. You already saw some of the strawberries we had uh, picked earlier here at Hickory Ridge Farm. But don't worry, there's a lot more strawberries, uh, strawberries to be picked out. Just look at how big this field truly is. And we have Robin Pierce with the farm uh, again. So, you know, throughout the morning, you told us um, the outlook, why people enjoy it. But tell us, what are some things that people shouldn't do when they strawberry pick? Uh, so. Well, in, in the past, it's always been a part of the experience to sample in the field. And so we just, this year, we're kind of steering away from doing that as much as uh, people did in the past, just given the current situation. And you were actually saying that you guys have quite a bit of strawberries. You're at a peak. Yeah, so we are, so strawberries kind of come in and they peak and then they start to wind down towards the end of the month. Right now, we are at peak picking time. So we're running a special till Friday where for you pick, if you do two you pick buckets, you get one for free. And of course, otherwise, if if, if nobody picks these strawberries, they're going to go to waste. Important. Yeah, so there's always a certain amount of, of loss, you know, with um, the strawberry production. But, you know, the best case scenario is that we would get as many out of the field as we possibly can. And so, like I said, a lot of strawberries definitely for uh, you to pick right here at Hickory Ridge Farms. It's right on Battlefield Boulevard, right off of uh, Route 168, right here in Chesapeake. So hopefully you'll have a very good experience.